Good afternoon and welcome to Shine Chats, where we're bringing Team Shine members together with industry experts. We're broadcasting live from the Greater New York meeting here in New York City. My name's John Cox. I've got the pleasure to, this afternoon to have Aiden My Butler, pleasure is mine, our John. CEO of Guard Lab. Aiden, tell us about Guard Lab. Yes, yeah, so we're, we're a mouth guard company, predominantly sports mouth guards. Um, we're a couple of years old now, and we are lucky enough to have started the company at a time that digital dentistry is really on the up and up and really right. on the forefront of technology. And we are, yeah, we use complete digital end-to-end -end solutions to make our products. So from an accuracy standpoint and a, uh, you know, just an ease and customer service standpoint, right. it's really helped us along as a business. So, mouth cards. Mouth cards been around for years. 50 years. Years, yeah. 20 years for sure. Yeah. Take an impression, put on a stolen model, make a yeah. mouth card. Tell me how you've incorporated digital technology into the Absolutely. process. And, so what, what we found was the, the old fashioned you know, method of using alginate and stone models, um, whilst it's pretty accurate, it's from a customer service standpoint and from a customer experience standpoint, or as we call it, a user, you know, an interface standpoint, right. just not very pleasant. Um, that's the first thing we've been able to improve by using digital. The second thing is really the speed and turnaround time. Um, not having to ship impressions anymore, and right. as I'm sure most of the viewers will know, shipping impressions isn't isn't great. You know, they're uh, pliable, they move. Um, so from an accuracy standpoint, it's been even better. Uh, okay. We have the benefit of being able to reissue the scans once we have you. We don't no longer have to send the patient back into the dental office to get another impression. You know, as long as the teeth haven't moved, we can reuse the same digital scans, which from a speed and a turnaround time and an accuracy standpoint is far superior. So that, that's got to be a huge advantage. I've got sons that play hockey. Yeah. And I can tell you that they go through mouth guards and they have to get them done again yeah. and done again. So yeah. with the digital file, you've got it on record, they simply reach out. Reach out. Send um, the file, the file gets generated through, the dentist can dentist send again. to the dentist. Absolutely, and the other benefit is the cost reduction from a second. One of those, again, your viewers will know, one of the biggest expenses in production of mouthpieces and mouth guards for sports and for bruxism, apnea, is really producing the models in the first place. It takes a lot of time, okay. and from a 3D printing standpoint, is it quite expensive? Because we are able to store the physical models, right. um, we get to really reduce the price from you know, what is normally a fairly expensive thing down to what we say you know, is uh, really cost effective. Okay. And, um, a lot quicker, so it's, uh, we, okay. get that, we get that so double you're, benefit. You're delivering performance, more accuracy, and uh, accessibility. Accessibility, and um, you know, the, the world seems to be completely going in you know, the direction of customer service. People right. now don't really flag, app, um, flag cabs anymore, they get an Uber. Right. So for us, we like to think we're leaning, we're obviously with the partners that you've got and all the scan technology out there, right. we go in more, really in the uh, direction of customer service first. So, uh, Henry Schein, social responsibility is a big part of, of our absolutely, footprint. Absolutely. Uh, Henry Schein cares, it's important what we give back to the community. Yeah. Here at the Greater New York, you touched uh, 75, 80 kids. Maybe yeah. talk a little bit about the program, how you've provided the, uh, so, the access to uh, performance, professional guards that maybe uh, we had an NBA player here that, that wears yeah. a guard to these young kids. Maybe tell the story, that's a great Certainly, message. Certainly, yeah, we are, as, as we're lucky because we're a new company, we've really started uh, the business with a socially responsible theme to it. You know, we want to be able to give back. And in having a partnership with Henry Shine, the DNA of Henry Shine really has a social responsibility core to it with Shine Cares. Um, so we are, we've been really blessed to partner with not only Shine, but on the charitable standpoint, charities such as Big Brothers Big Sisters, Right to Play, um, and be able to offer uh, product and guards and an experience to kids who ordinarily wouldn't have access to this from a couple of reasons. A, because you know, going to the dentist isn't a cheap thing. Um, not everybody goes as often as they perhaps should, and being English, obviously, I'm, uh, I, I know all about that. Uh, but yeah, no, it's, it's given us the ability to now give back to kids who really deserve it and to show that there is a better way. Um, and I think, as you saw today, there was a lot of energy and a lot of our ambassadors and athletes right. love to come along and spend time with the kids. Um, but the platform and the partnership with Henry Shine really allows that to happen. You know, That's that fabulous. socially responsible DNA that is kind of baked into Henry Shine is yeah. perfect for a small company like ours. That's fabulous. How about, uh, how does the dentist get involved? How does the dentist uh, utilize the technology? We've got obviously portfolio scanners. Right. I think you receive files from... Uh, from pretty much all scanners all at scanners. this point, yeah. Tell me how a dentist might get involved and, and move to this uh, digital workflow and providing these performance guards 
uh, within their practice. So it, it's quite simple. I mean, really, it's as simple as a dentist going to GuardLab.com and actually signing up to become a dentist. Um, we supply everything that is needed um, from training through to just explaining the different workflow because, again, adding a new product line, even though a lot of dentists do sell mouthpieces, this is a really a new product line because of the, you know, the ability to sell branded product, the sport, the marketing that comes with it. So um, we sign dentists up, we give them a little bit of training, just showing how the file transfer comes through to us. And then we, uh, we actually work with each dental practice to do some geo-targeted advertising around the area right. to really drum up some excitement from local schools, sports teams. So it's really a win-win. Um, helps dentists market. And uh, you know, the bigger picture is really driving new patients to a practice uh, with something new and exciting to talk about. Fabulous. Where does it go from here? What's, what's next on the technology oh, what's forefront? Next? World of, uh, domination of the mouth guard. Uh, <laughs> so we're launching internationally quite quickly. We've uh, we recently launched in um, Australia, which is really neat. Uh, we've got the UK coming online very soon, and we've also launched in Canada. So Europe is the next obvious choice for us, and obviously with a partner such as yourselves, that global coverage gives us the ability to you know, outreach and touch local charities to each new domain. Mm -hmm. uh, so no, it's really, really cool. So that's the next step is growth, more dentists in the network, um, you know, more charities, uh, and yeah, yeah, more fun, as we try. Yeah, well, you, you do have fun. We try, we try. So I'm going to ask the question you probably get asked by everybody. Concussions has been a big uh, discussion Absolutely, topic yeah. in sport. Performance guards, understanding the guards that you provide, help, help the athlete uh, uh, perform at a higher level. Right. Let's talk about maybe share your thoughts on, on the importance of the guard to protect the athlete Absolutely. when they're playing some of these uh, so, collision sports. So as impact sports go, concussion is, is a real, it's an epidemic, right? There's a lot of unknowns about it. And no way would we ever say that a mouth guard is going to be a concussion prevention device. It, it's just not. Right. But from a protection, especially when you're talking soft tissue, um, you're talking just you know, protecting your pearly whites, Mouth guards are hugely important, and there's a bunch of other benefits that come with being properly protected. Um, so, even though there are only a few sports that mandate the use of mouth guards, you're seeing now a lot more sports come online um, that don't mandate the use, but makes a lot of sense for the athletes, young and old. Mm -hmm. Sometimes better for the olds that are old, olds like me, and you don't bounce back right. as quickly. Uh, so, some, you know, we, we really believe that sports as a as a whole topic should really be paying more attention to protection. Um, and from that, the benefits are pretty obvious. Yeah, I agree. Well, listen, I can't, I can't, number one, I can't thank you enough for the partnership, what you brought into the uh, Greater New York meeting and supporting the, our initiative here with uh, yeah. Henry Schein Cares, thank you. with Big Brothers and Sisters and Right to Play. The, yeah. There's no question the kids were uh, They, they, they really the had moon. a good day, yeah. yeah. Nearly as good moon. a day as we did, but over they did the have moon. a good day. So, uh, we, and, and, th and thank and you, thank you to Henry I appreciate Schein. you uh, pulling technology into an area that otherwise probably wasn't there, so no, you're, it's you're it's helping a, advance and accelerate technology within dentistry. It's a neat format, dentistry. as we say, it all starts with the scan. So the ability for dentists to have digital equipment, but actually start to get some real use out of it time and time again, and not right. constantly be worried about the, you know, the complexity of the technology, but just to really use these scanners for what they were intended for, which is scanning right. teeth. Um, but yeah, no, thank you so much to you. Thank you to your team. Brian Allen has been a huge help to us, and uh, without him, I don't think we'd all be here today. So thanks to Brian well, as well. well John, th thanks thank again, you so Abe. much. Appreciate, appreciate it. it. Thank appreciate you. it. Thank you for uh, tuning in to Henry Shine Chats. Uh, please uh, join us for the next session that will be coming on later on today. Enjoy the rest of your day. Thank you. Thank you.